Tonight, we learned it was a trail of motor oil that led Mercedes police to the suspect in yesterday's deadly hit and run crash. Authorities say they followed the trail from the crash scene to the suspect's location just a few blocks away. They also found a truck at that location, a yellow truck, which matched the description they received from witnesses. The Channel 5's Angela Vargas was on the scene shortly after the crash happened. He joins us with new information. A family in shock. They never expected their loved ones to be victims of a hit and run. It's a very large family out here and it's very difficult. Mercedes Police Chief Olga Maldonado says investigators arrested and charged Ignacio Navarro Jr. with intoxication manslaughter and assault. We wanted to know how smaller Valley Police Departments track down unlawful drivers. Chief Maldonado tells us every department has different resources. Yeah, I work plenty of hit and runs. Alamo police officer Juan Meza explains investigators use wreckage debris as evidence and a number of other ways to help find a hit and run driver. The ability to photograph, to match up, to do moldings of the accident, moldings of the tires. Meza says the best tools are witnesses. The people who are around the accident, those are the people who are going to be able to tell you what type of vehicle it was, how the accident occurred. He says once that is done, officers provide that description to other city police agencies. Meza adds drivers involved in a crash should think twice before leaving. Which is the same thing as getting a speeding ticket or it could go up to a third degree felony. If somebody, uh, if there's a major accident, you cause an accident, the person passes away. It could end up being a second degree felony where you could end up doing, being charged with a crime that you could possibly do two to ten years and pay a $10,000 fine. The suspect or suspects will be arrested, leaving families grieving, wishing it was a nightmare. In Alamo, Angelo Vargas, Channel 5 News at 10. Well, we wanted to know more on what witnesses should do at the scene of an accident. This is a Channel 5 News Extra. Alamo Police Chief, uh, or Alamo Police Officer, that is, Juan Mesa, you just heard him in Angela's story, explains if you witness an accident, stay there until police arrive, also if possible, and in a safe manner, try to get pictures with your cell phone.